I've been active in my community for the last 10, 15, 20 years. And over the last five years I've seen a lot of devastation caused by the policies of the governments, past and present. And the devastation, the devastating effect it's having on communities and people in Sligo. People who have worked hard all their lives, have been made redundant and been made to pay for the mistakes of other people, the bankers and the speculators. People who are unemployed and on the margins are being hammered through cuts in services and the benefits that they were getting. Everybody is paying for the mistakes of and the lead in this country. And I've seen the effects this has on my community and I've decided that none of the established parties have done anything about it. If you look at our hospital for an example, all the cuts that are taking place there, they've removed the cancer services, now they're on about removing the maternity services, they're removing machinery in there that was paid for by local people. Also you have the, the St John's issue, you have the library service locally that's been decimated. You know, they don't have the personnel to, to run a proper library service. And these are all effects of paying off bondholders. And it affects people every way. People on waiting lists in hospitals, people that wait to see, wait to see a doctor, people looking for a medical card, carers looking for, for aids for the people they're looking after, people with disabilities not getting proper child support that they need, you know. These are all the effects of austerity. If enough people in Ireland vote for candidates from the left, people be for profit or running 50 candidates, and other people vote for other left-leaning parties or independents, it will be felt at a national level. If you vote again for the likes of Fianna Fáil, Fianna Gael and Labour, who told you, said one thing before the elections and done the complete opposite then when they got in, they'll do the very same again. If you vote for them again, you're only endorsing all the policies they've brought in so far. What we are saying is, come and get involved in parties like ourselves and make the change yourself. People are, are the only people that can make the change. Finally, I'm about to make, make this plea for people to go out and vote. It's very important that we vote, because only by voting can we make a change. And hopefully you will vote people before Province Sligo.